Well, hello there, you wonderful humans, and welcome back to Power World. Hope everybody's having a great day. Uh, we're back playing our uh, Nuzlocke here, which has been going uh, pretty well. Actually, we should probably repair before we head out, uh, which has been going pretty well. We got things, some things collected. We got a couple of Vixies. Uh, we got our first mount at the end of the last live stream as well. Oh god, I'm hitting the wrong buttons yet again. Uh, I just want to repair all. Yes, there we go. Um, probably gonna do our first cave today, but I would like to get some uh, some more levels. Like we have venison here, who um, not a bad deer. Uh, apparently the does it think I'm near the wood? I don't know what's going on. Okay, no idea what's going on there. Can I ride you? Does it still think I'm near the wood? It does. Okay, we just had to hit escape. Perfect. Very odd. But yeah, I hope everybody's having a great day. Yeah, we got Venison here, who's going to be our wonderful, wonderful pal for helping us gather up all the things that we need. Low-level pals. I honestly think um, the Ichthyrdeer, or however you pronounce their names, are just really good in general. So it's good to have it on our team. Le Cremy. Probably need some more fox bark to level that up. There we go. Gotta get them levels, you know? Get ready with the food names? Exactly. So we gotta catch four more fox barks to max that out. I don't even think we've caught enough chickens, honestly, either. I think we need a, so we have a Vixie Claws, but we might, we might need a Chicopee Claws too. I mean, we can always make money other ways uh, to buy eggs, but I'm realizing there's no way to actually breed for Chicopees. You can only get a Chicopee by breeding with a Chicopee or else you get something else, which is a little bit of a problem. It's not a huge problem or anything. I wonder if these skill fruits are only available at the beginning when the game launches, because I never see them again uh, once the game, or like, once you start a server. I don't know if they ever like actually respawn. I think we can jump across that, probably not. Probably not successfully, at least. Let's see, so we're gonna unlock some of these fast travel points. Smug, how you doing? Daniel Luisa, CM, uh, Amazon Bree. Hope everybody's having a great day. God, do I love this deer. Such a nice early game, pal. You think the fruits on the ground do respawn? Interesting. So we haven't caught any new pals today yet. Say what? Are you dead? Ah, you just lived. Nice. The crummy soccer. Exactly. It's kind of what it's like, isn't it? Um, actually, let's finish. Let's finish going to that other area. Oh, that's a real poopy gumas. Tell you what. Excuse me, sir. Would like you to just get in the ball. Bego, thank you for everything you do. Bego, I hope you're having a great day. It's good to see you. Mm -mm. I've never seen those uh, those things on the ground. The fruits on the ground respawn on a multiplayer server, at least. Guess I haven't played long enough on a single player server to uh, see it happen, or maybe I just didn't notice. Probably the latter. A few days ago, I caught a frost stallion. The day after, I bred for a frost stallion. Knocked and use your favorite ride pal. Frost stallion knocked is pretty fire. I'm not gonna lie. It's probably one of my favorite, uh, favorite mounts. It's super fast, super good. Cheer. 
I have not been doing anything all, at all day to try and snuggle. Can, can you not lick my hand? Thank you, sir. Ooh, Morty Fonts. <laughs> Try and run. I forgot T Fonts. They're a little too thick, so the game won't let you run them over like it'll let you run over everything else. You're currently working on unlocking the map. Nice. Alright, maybe more monkey boys. How many? We got 22 more balls left. Wasn't sure if that other tansy was going to aggro, so... The way I like handling tansies is just continuously stun both of them. Because their little grass attack sucks because they can spam it 24-7. That one. But, sir! <laughs> You're stuck trying to kill Eileen? Uh, Fox Parks will do really good with that one. Not because Fox Parks is... I mean, Fox Parks is already super OP. Uh, but, I mean, fire types... Definitely help you, Clapper. Oh, we can, we can make the triple shot bow now, I think. I should have just... There we go. Try that again. This will be our first celery. See what we get. Hopefully it's something good for breeding. It's a pyromaniac celery. Oh boy, that's a bummer. <laughs> Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Could have been better. Level 14, let's go. You keep getting distracted by eggs and chests. Nah, it's super easy to get distracted like that, that's for sure. Boop, boop, doop, boop, boop, boop. We got a fwack. Have we caught a fwack yet? I don't think we have. Alright, which fwack we get in here? We're going to get the level 5 fwack. It feels appropriate. I like that the other flacks don't even notice. That their buddy is just getting clapped right now. Ooh, got a flack with Sirius. Nice. That'll do. Perfect. So we need a flack and a celery name. Yeah. <laughs> Ferocious Chicopee. <laughs> oh boy. But yeah, no, uh, there'll be more content updates for the game eventually. But if you do find yourselves getting burnt out or bored of the game, take a break. There's so many good games out there, and Shrouded is amazing. Um, we've got uh, Nightingale coming out in a couple days, which will which will be a really really good time. I think a lot of people will enjoy that a lot. All right, so we need food names for Celeray, who kind of already has a food name, and Flack. All right, let's see here. We got Celeray. This was the first one. Probably the worst pal I've ever caught, maybe. I second the Turducken. We'll name we'll name Flack Turducken. We'll go with Pancake here. And then how'd Turducken come out? 56, 49, 58, and it's serious. Perfect. Uh, 
Alright, so this one will get sent back here. This one will go back here. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot we named our Tansy Guac. Triple shot bow. We got metal spear. A crossbow. Ah, uh, finally mega spheres. Okay. That'll be good. Where's the triple shot bow? Am I dumb? Did I learn? There it is. Three shot bow. Just need stone. Can you play more in Shrouded? I know it kind of got lost in the mix, but like watching the building. Yeah, I know the building is the best part of Enshrouded, but that's not that's not what I would end up streaming. So I feel like uh, feel like a lot of people are in love with Enshrouded for, I mean, a multitude of reasons, but uh, I kind of missed the boat on it. And um, I don't know. I almost streamed it today and then I decided not to. Maybe, maybe I should have. I don't know. We'll find out. The Hobbit hole needs to be a thing. Now, Entrated looks Entrated looks awesome. I would love to to play it, but I've also been horribly, horribly addicted to Nightingale. Boop, 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 boop. Where is Tansy when you need him? Dude, why are you... Come here. You should be touching the stuff. Come here. And... Yoink. No pseudo-boodabee. No pseudo-boodabee. No pseudo Future zombie, thank you for becoming a bean. Welcome. You should. Would love to see more. Maybe we'll do it tonight. Lift Monk could help. Is Lift Monk in my party? Lift Monk is in my party. Oh, yeah. There we go. Alright, what are we missing? We need an egg basket. Whoops. Oh, you know what we can do? We can make our first... We got our first tech point, which means we can make our first egg incubator. We just need cloth. Any suggestion what to breed with my first cake? I can only get one right now. Um, let's see an Anubis if you can. <laughs> Which TV to watch you on? He's in the bedroom watching your stream, and I'm in the living room watching your stream. Oh my goodness! It's a TV battle. So let's give us to, enough to make two incubators, which means we should be able to hatch both the eggs that we have. Although, which egg do we want to hatch is the real question, you know? All right, how many of these? We need to start doing some organization too. We got wooden multiple baskets, which we don't need. Gotta keep those in one. We got berries in multiple. So we got three eggs. I wanna ha I wanna hatch this dark, this large dark egg. Hopefully, hopefully we get lucky. I'm hoping that it is a Tombat. A Tombat would be so nice.
I think that Tansy will work on this, but not anything else. <laughs> I got 14 minutes on that. We'll have to come back and check that. And we'll make one more. Maybe we'll do the... The ice egg. Hey, Jennifer. How are you doing? Hopefully the internet won't do that again. Hopefully! Yeah, that was rough yesterday. Ended up just taking a nap after. Which is fine. Some sleep never hurt nobody. Yeah, maybe checking on some enshrouded wouldn't be so bad. You need all the naps. <laughs> I'm pretty well rested after uh, after the Power World grind. I'm kind of just taking it easy in between recording. Like uh, I haven't started recording Nightingale stuff and just kind of just getting through all the uh, through the whole game. I have clip. Well, I have a lot of stuff recorded. Just haven't actually tried to like put stuff together. When I catch a Relaxosaurus, call it Bronto Burger. Oh my god, good old Bronto Burger. And we're just going to go to sleep, so that way we can get some help with this. Man, the Vixies really do help out the early game. As far as PAL spheres go. <laughs> and yeah, YouTube likes to do that where it'll unsubscribe you from things. It does the same thing with memberships, too. It's super weird. But 100% a thing. You should so that I don't go through sleepless nights again. That's true. It's, I don't know if the game's going to do super well yet. <sighs> Alright, we're going to do fire egg. Maybe we'll end up hatching something better than ours. Here, go lay down. Your bed's right there, bud. Go lay down. You have a comical number of pal spears from it? Nice. Alright, so we are level 14. Our pals are under leveled at the moment. Ooh. We need to go defeat another boss because we need an auto food thing. So that way we're not accidentally starving all of our pals. So that's bad news bears. We do have lots of berries being made up, so we should be okay on food. Alright, what's the next boss we should... You know what, let's just tame some more things first. Yeah. Picked up our new kitten today, a five-month-old black and white kitty called Luna. She's so cute, that's adorable. Congratulations. Because he's TNT. He's a pangolur. TNT. Gonna catch you in the butt. I feel like we should just probably max out our early game pals here real quick. Oh, excuse me, sir? Bungie with the 58 months, edging closer to five years. It's crazy how time flies. Absolutely insane. Thank you so much for being a part of the community. Wonderful, wonderful human. Oh, snap. I knew that was going to kill it too. Dang it. Oh, I kind of want to go. I kind of want to go get a ruby. Because then Ruby will boost the uh, the ability of our Fox Sparks, which would be really nice. And any other pals that we have that are fire type. Have I caught a Lavander yet? No, they're not until later game. We have raids turned off because they've been super buggy. And I like to at least play through this uh, series without it dying again. I know we've had that happen a few times. It's super frustrating. I really hate when it happens. I hate rest... Well, I mean, to be fair, I love restarting in survival games. 
but I hate that it keeps happening on these series. But to be fair, in the last one, we did go th through it fully. And I'm really liking the uh, the Nuzlocke version of this. Oh, little gooey boy. We made our three-shot bow, didn't we? Yeah, I'm not losing my mind. There we go. Come here, penguin boy. Oh, 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 oh. Hmm? Skirt, skirt! Oh, Jesus. Wait. Yeah, we cut, we cut it to fun already. We need to catch a Capriti is what we need to catch. Wait, actually, I think... Yep. Megasphere. Oh. Yeah. Imagine if the rules required every pal. So uh, it just requires me to name the the first pal. Because we have to catch so many pals purposely for leveling up. If we had to name every pal, it would be it'd be a little ridiculous. I'll have to go look at that, Bungie. Sorry. I've pretty much... As much as I hate to say it, I've pretty much eliminated, like, most social media and all. I don't even have my phone on me nowadays. I don't even know when people message me on my phone for days. It's, uh... Been full-blown hermit mode. For a hot minute. Aside from just updating people on what's going on with the servers and stuff. Alright, so let's see here. I want to take down another boss. I don't think there's one down here. Should name a fire type grilled cheese? I approve of this message. I 100% agree. We can start condensing some of the pals that we're using on our team, too. Um, the only question to that is, do we want to breed for a better Fox Sparks? Do we want to take... I don't know if we've caught in any named pals yet that would be good for breeding for a better Fox Sparks yet. Uh, we can take a look at that here. Well, we can't until they're level 19. I guess we should maybe not condense stuff until level 19, at least. We provide the names, all I gotta do is type. No, I have to go to my box. If we can have a box anywhere, then it would be a lot easier. That would take a lot from the stream, though, to name every single pal we catch when we're literally just going around catching everything to try and level up right now. I wanna fight another boss. Ooh, another serious chicken boy. Not that that particularly helps us, because uh, we can't use it for breeding. We're only using their named pals for breeding. Let's stop using arrows. I don't know why I'm doing that. Le Cremy! Oh, Christ on a muffin. Bonk! So the nice thing about leveling up this way is since pals have a catch-up mechanic to catch up to, like, your level, if you out-level your pals, all you gotta do is, like, kill a boss or ten <laughs> to catch up. Right, how many Kremi do we have? Oh my god, Musclehead and Ferocious? What the heck? You've gotta be kidding me. 
I got so distracted with the muscle head and ferocious, I didn't see how many I caught. God, that makes me so sad. We haven't seen a single lucky yet either. Oh, bro. Bro! Get in the ball. Pissing me off with that back-skipping, fluffy butt craziness. My character's cruising for a bruising right now. Alright, I'm assuming we have ten... We have ten Kremis, because I've missed it three times in a row. And if I'm missing it three times in a row, we either have ten or I'm... You know, just a, a terrible streamer. Which we all know that one, but... There should be ultra-rare passes that happen 1 in 1,000 pals that has a very stupid OP power level on a normally weak pal. That'd be kind of cool. Red. Ooh. A common egg, you say. What could be in that terrible, small, common egg? Alright, we need to take down a Melpaca. But my armor's broken already. I don't even know how the hell that happened already. I literally just repaired everything. Oh, of course it's hitting me rather than the deer. Yeah. What? How did you Did you just kill yourself? Oh, that was rude. Oh, we got a stone egg. Hmm. Strawberry milkshake. Strawberry milkshake's a great name for a melpaca. I think it murdered itself, though. I don't... <laughs> I don't know what happened. Oh, that definitely murdered that. Whoops. There's two right there. So one's got to be named Strawberry Milkshake, huh? Get in the ball, get in the ball, get in the ball. Get in the ball, get in the ball, get in the ball. In the ball. Huh. Oh, God, I got to kill a pal. Ah. Oh. I don't even know what happened. God dang, I got clapped. What was that? Oh, shoot. All my pals dropped, too. Oh, I forgot about that. All right, what are we hatching? What are we hatching? Let's see what the first one is. It is... Ooh, and our socks. Okay. What are you gonna be named? I'm gonna name you Pizza. Because you're probably gonna be making us pizza. Okay, which of our pals do we want to sacrifice? Oh, man. You know what, Matcha... Macho, I'm not horribly attached to you, buddy. I like Big Tuna. Big Tuna's not great. Sausage isn't great. You do have Work Slave on you, though. Oh, Big Tuna. Big Tuna. I'm sorry, buddy. You're a coward. 
No, you've got great stats, though. Oh, no. Oh, the decisions. All right, it's got to... No, we need pancake. No, we don't... We don't necessarily need pancake. We don't need pancake. <sighs> okay, we need to butcher pancake. Oh, man. What level is the the meat cleaver? Five ingots. Okay. All right, so pancake's going to be on the chopping block. Oh, it's so sad. <laughs> sure. Is it from your active team? I don't know if we clarified on that rule. It can be from the active team if we want to be it from if we wanted to be from the active team. Uh, did we put did we say that in the rules? Hold on, let me check. Um, if the palace KO'd, we have to butcher it. Uh, if I die, I must choose a pal to sacrifice from my active team. I did, I did specify that. Whoop! That was dumb. If you kill a pal, can you recatch the same pal again? No, no, you cannot. Rip over the good pals. Well, I don't know. They're necessarily the good ones. Those are just the ones we had on our team. But yeah. rip a to a pal. Do, 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 do. That rule seems to be really harsh. Yeah, but it's it's good. Biz Pineapple, thank you for the 37 months. Finally, kind of sort of maybe fix my sleep schedule. Hope everyone is doing well. Thanks for always keeping me entertained. Nice. I'm glad you're fixing your sleep schedule. That's good. Here, why do you always have to do... Do you like being beat? I don't... You n you have all day to snuggle. And it's always when I stream. He's like, I'm the real streamer here. Maybe that's what he wants to be, a cat streamer. We just need... an. Some kind of program to let cats play video games. It would be glorious. <laughs> Tear. It's just out of your head button everything. <laughs> Did I forget to change the title of the stream? I did. Whoops. Let's see here. Our world. I'd be like those fish that spent all that money. <laughs> All right, we got our bag back. We got our pals back. Ah. Oh, this is a big bummer. We got to figure out who we're going to murder. Man. It's going to be a sad day. The saddest of sad days. I like all of these pals. I think it's going to have to be Omelette. Omelette saw this coming for a long time. You can already see the darkness in its eyes. It knew it was going to be the first sacrifice. It knew it the whole time. It's, it's, it's going to have to be Omelette. How are you going to get eggs? I'm going to buy them. <laughs> 
Or I'm gonna kill a lot of omelets to get them. The emotional damage just makes you stronger. Butcher the chicken. Oh, it's so true. What? Huh? Chair. Oh, he's gonna get me killed. <sighs> Beardo Fat, thank you for coming to Bean. Alright, ten of ten of those. Alright, so this means we need some ingots. Oh, Omelette. You're going to let you live one last day out on the range, alright, bud? Oh, boy. What are we going to get here from this large dark egg? Hey, it's a Tombat, baby! Just what I wanted. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we need a great Tombat name. What does this beautiful thing look like? Oh, thank you, Hazel. Loving the Nuzlocke streams. Thank you, thank you. God, I love Tombat. Such a great early game, pal. Wait, why am I using Flambe instead of socks? We named him Pizza for a reason. Where'd he go? All right, Flambe can go back in here. Pizza, there we go. Level two Torchy boy. Count Chocolatia? Wait, what? <laughs> Count Chocolate? That's not a food, though. That's a that's a mascot of a food. It's a great it's a great thought. It's got to be food based. Licorice. We got pineapple chow mein. Couscous. Sure, because we'll be using them for a while. I don't know if that's how you spell couscous, but I just I copied what I saw in chat. Okay, if it's spelled wrong, it's not my fault. All right, one one butcher's knife. We're gonna need this for a while, so it's gotta be a it's gotta be a good one. And we'll even make it ourselves. It's a cereal, though. Does that count? I guess it counts. Omelette. You were a good pal. You didn't really... I mean, you, you, you kind of carried us early in the game. Don't run from me. Well, we'll take you to a nice little corner. It's a sunset death. You know, you treated us great. You learned Dragon Burst. You didn't live a bad life, you know? Did you live a great life? Maybe not. But it wasn't It wasn't a bad life either, you know? Come here. We're going to feed you a nice little piece of bread. Who's a good baby? Come here. You want bread? And then we'll give it a nice little pet. See, it was a good chicken. And then 
Oh God. I'm sorry, Oblet. Oh God. Oh, I'll cook his body. Well, welcome to the Nuzlocke, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome, welcome. That that extra rule we made, it's mean. It's definitely mean. Oh, boy. Okay, who's going to replace the omelet in our lineup here? Uh, let's see here. Tur maybe Turducken? We don't have a water type. <laughs> Turducken, Turducken's got serious. What is our... Oh, we can't make a Turducken do that. I need a signpost now. <laughs> For all the fallen pals. That doesn't sound like a bad idea. And we just need wood, right? Did we, did we learn the sign? I don't think we did. I'll put the graveyard up here. Is that how I spelled Omelette's name? I probably should remember that. All right. Here lies omelette. Not the best chicken, but a chicken we loved. Oh, it doesn't fit. Man, the text in this game sucks. Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> okay, what were we doing? We were doing something. Oh, yeah, we were trying to get you a strawberry milkshake, and then it ruined our whole day. We need to repair our armor again. Oh, my God. Great, now I have to play a Nuzlocke. Oh, Caitlin. Oh, no. Good luck, ma'am, with the emotional damage. Maybe you'll do better than I did. Maybe you won't get clapped by a freaking fuzzy strawberry milkshake llama. your eighth ad? What the heck? It's been every five minutes for all the streams lately. What the hell? That's absolutely insane. I spelled the omelet wrong on the sign. I'm pretty sure that's how I spelt it for the pal, so that's all I care about. All right, so we've got cloth outfit, but I feel like we should probably get a different cloth outfit. We've got the tundra outfits. We just got pelt armor. Oh, that's made in the advanced workbench, isn't it? Which means we need nails. I don't know what I spelt it. It's dead to us. Mm 
<laughs> God, we need a better handicrafter. Guac seems to really be happy with his job, though. Right, so we need... A high qu oh my god, 15 ingots? And 10 nails. Oh, Christ. Alright, well, we know where we're going. Because we don't have any of that. I guess we do have to repair our armor. That's a bit of a bummer. What? All right, we don't have to carry the meat cleaver around with us. That's just extra weight. <laughs> That's so sad. Man, figuring out organization. Oh, I definitely don't need all these eggs on us either. So this will be our first rocky egg and our first common egg. Come on, venison. The sign is inside the circle, so it's not going to degrade. Is there a... Yeah, there's a fast travel point. We can kill that Chillit again, too. Or we can catch it, rather. We meant to do that last time, but I think we got afraid of dying, so we... Murdered it instead. How did I not? Yeah. So we need to go up. You can't make it through here, right? Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. Leftover spaghetti for chill it. Is there another chillet up here? Wouldn't mind capturing one. Do we have... We have two mega balls. We got two mega balls and a chillet. Oh shoot, that T-Fon's getting in the middle of this too. Oh shoot. Why me? I got hit by that? God dang it. Ooh. Ooh, one day we'll catch one. God dang. That dark move still hit me, but I guess it has like an AoE little blast at the end. Kind of sucks. Almost clapped. That's what happens when there's four times damage turned on. Going to Hamley Day dinner on Monday in Canada and making Ponyo shaped macaroons. Ooh. Loving pal streams. Kind of the only thing keeping me sane. Cook my joe. That sounds awesome. Wish you safe travels. Travels? Travels. One of those things. A 
Gotta work on leveling up the base at some point too. Stamp, what'd it do? How are ya? Take on a different boss because I really want to unlock the feedback. Isn't there supposed to be a fast travel point right here? Am I losing my mind? I guess it really is just down there. I don't know why I felt like there was one closer. Pretty. I think maybe we'll avoid that for right now. Just want to get my high grade bench going. Yeah, stamp. I died to a a milkshake llama, and I had to uh, had to butcher omelet. Unfortunately, sometimes that's the way the omelet cookie crumbles. Why is our socks on the roof? Good lord. Alright, what do we get from our first common egg in this area? A Rebunny. So we need a Rebunny name and we need... Oh my god, a Hang You? Interesting. So Rebunny and a Hang You. We need food names for these. Where? Oh, the Rabunny went to my party. <laughs> Skilled fingers. 92 IV and health. So marshmallow for Rabunny. Okay, we can do that. Alright, so you're going to go over here. Oh, Lord, why did I go the long way? Rocky Road. Oh, my God, I went the long way again. What is wrong with me? Oh, wow. Okay. Rocky Road. Okay. And Hang is such a weird-looking pal. The pal deck description is terrifying, by the way. You know, I've never looked at Hang Yu's pal deck description. Its gigantic arms can rip apart even iron. As a particularly cruel form of execution, serious criminals would be strung up in a public square and hang you would tear their skin from their bodies. <whistles> Interesting. How do we know this when nobody really knows anything about this island? That's very dark. Well, Jesus... Alright, well I'm good to I'm glad to know that our socks or that pals still just get stuck on roofs for no reason. That's cool. Would you kindly did you already do the thing? No. That's right. Do the thing, please. Alright, so that'll get us our iron. I feel like I should get more. Cause we're gonna need it for all the new tools. Uh, so we'll do one more load of iron. There's lore. I know, I know there's lore. I just haven't gotten too far into it. Oh, so much reading. Blah. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Name him Stranger Danger. <laughs> Ooh, almost hit a tansy. Actually, we haven't caught all of our tansies yet. That might not be the worst idea. Oh, God, I used the Megasphere. That sucked. Am I getting more sleep? Yeah, no, I'm sleeping great. It's good. Did that just... I'm getting plenty of rest while uh, gearing up for the next game. We got a couple of games coming out. <clears throat> we got Dragon's Dogma 2 coming out uh, next month. I don't have really access to that one, but I probably should reach out. You gonna kill you? Okay, you're alive. Good. That's good. Bonk. Like the deer is just like, yeah, slap that rock. Ugh. Man. All right, what are the chances this works? Drowning doesn't count. I'm doing a test, okay? For speed purposes of getting, <laughs> you know what, we can do this without testing death potential, but that's not how I like to test things. I believe I can fly. I don't have a freaking glider yet. <laughs> oh, God. What? Yep, never made one a really bad test when you've never actually made a glider yet. <laughs> oh, man. What a tragedy. Bex, what's going on? Maybe we should probably make one of those now. For science. I'm level 42 and I've never once made a glider. <laughs> if you have a glider pal on your team at all times, it's not bad, but... Um, I'll probably end up getting a Galehawk, but they seem super... They're just broken all the time. So I'm not as uh, in love with them as I once was. We had four already, so we need six... I need to make three of these, and then we should be able to make our high-quality workbench. Man, look at all those pal spheres. Let's go. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, we have an ice, uh, we have an ice egg in here, too. We have to get rid of this fire egg, because we opened up one already. What the heck? What? There it is. I guess we can hatch it, but we can't use it, right? Might as well hatch it. So I'm just tossing it away, we just can't use it.
Grapple guns are super worth it for... I always have one on me. Because uh, if you get super encumbered, you can use it for movement. Great for moving bases. I always recommend having one on you. Comes in handy. Ooh, dragon cannon. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit. Okay. I find them useful. Right, gimme, and then we need to make high quality workbench. We're still low on ingots, oh my god. Thought I got enough. There we go, that should be enough to make our tools too. Do we need a Palsphere workbench too now? Really? God, I forgot how many upgrades you needed like right off the bat. Yep. Mega shield would be great. Cooking pot for sure. Which means we need the wheat plantation. We need all sorts of stuff. Medicine, we're never going to make medicine. <laughs> Alright, so a sphere workbench we can make. Oh, that uses all the nails. God dang it, man. Okay, perfect. Mega shields. Definitely want that bad boy. I guess it's upgrade time. It, it, okay, I thought Guac was in my party for a second. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> Philbert looks like he's just twerking all over it. We're not using uh, bugs or glitches or anything. And this playthrough, it's meant to be meant to be hard. And it's been really good, I think. The difficulty level's been pretty nice. Right, we got a mega shield, pelt armor. It's our first upgrade. We're definitely not using any melee weapons. It's just we take way too much damage. It's so easy to die in this playthrough. I mean, there's definitely certain games where bugs and glitches are super... super useful, where things are incredibly grindy, but this game's not that bad. On the grand scheme of things. We want a metal pick. Well, we got the ingots for it. Okay. Um, 
replace this. Little pickaxe, drop that. Discard both of these. It'll definitely be good at some point to have extra armor and things on us, but none of this stuff is worth actually using as extra armor yet, I don't think. What do we get? Oh, it's a flambelle. And, oh, a chillet. Oh, shoot, I wanted to get the alpha chillet, not one of these. Shoot. I didn't think about that. Alright, so the flambelle. We've already got a flambe, so we can't use that. We got a diet lover chillet. Your name's going to be Cheese Curd. You're never going to get used for anything. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Brought worst. <laughs> the, the worst name for a chillet ever. I don't know if we should still be able to get a regular chill out, but we hatched one, so. Hatched one from a wild egg. That's what we get for not paying attention. <coughs> chiclet for chillet? That's gotta be a food. I guess chiclet is a food name. That's, that's very true. Chiclet is a food name. Oh, somebody's stuck in a rock. God dang it. Who's stuck in a rock? Who's hungry right now? See you. Okay. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to do this while it's dark so that way we get, you know, we can sleep when we get back. I'll be right back. Sorry about that. I heard a very loud uh, crash upstairs, so I thought uh, the cats destroyed the entire world. And they kind of did. But it's okay. That's what cats do. I think, from my experience. <laughs> okay. 
Oh, it's morning time. Oh, no. We missed the ability to sleep. How's Kaden doing? He's doing very well. He's doing very well. He's a good boy. Good boy as always. All right, well, let's see here. What do we want to catch? I need a headpiece. We need more defense. I kind of... I kind of want to do a dungeon, but they're... I mean, they're level 13. We just died to a... We should do a dungeon. We should do a dungeon. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta try, right? We'll just do it smarter, better, stronger, faster. We need balls. Um, I can't really tell you how render distance works in the game. Basically, if your pals aren't rendered in, then they aren't gonna work. But that's all I can really tell you on that, unfortunately. Buy some meds, maybe? A dunce cap, maybe? I might need a dunce cap! <laughs> um, let's see here. Just got an alert to something. Hold on. Craziness. Whoops. <laughs> okay, so these are level 13. Oh, it's closed. Man. James, the best thing I can recommend is, like, get on a bird and fly away from it and see if things render, like, render out. Like, single player render distance is higher. There's a way you can set it in your game settings too. Um, but the only thing, the only recommendation I can give you is just see if it, see if the game renders, <laughs> like the pals. Like you can see, like that that mammoth just spawned in, so it's not very far. We still need one of these Melpacas. They clapped us last time. Oh, you know what? Let's do this the smart way. I ain't messing around with these Melpacas again. We need our strawberry milkshake, but we're going to do it the right way. We need... Oh my god, we need five ingots. Slap me in the face and call me Susie. God dang it. We're going to use, uh, I want to get the lift monk because it's also going to help with bosses. I want to get the lift monk saddle made, I should say. Can I dismount, please? Thank you. Yeah, this is a, a level 13 dungeon next to the uh, boss. It shouldn't be close because we haven't done it. should get us our lift monk saddle and we should be good to go oh i'm calling a strawberry milkshake doing something Science did work. 
perfect. Just gotta make sure to return it so it doesn't drown. That would be such a horrible, horrible way to lose a pal. I'd be so upset. Clapberry milkshake. Unfortunately, I don't think clapberry milkshakes are a thing. <laughs> Tansy. Ah, uh, you know, I've never really used Tansy's assault rifle. I mean, I have, but not nearly as much as Lift Monk. Just too chaotic for me. So it'll allow my third base to be cold storage for mass breeding. Lift Monk is better, honestly. Oh yeah, Lift Monk is definitely better than Tansy. 100%. I don't think those Mel Pack are up there anymore, so I'll have to get a revenge later. But we are ready for our first dungeon, and hopefully we don't have to kill anybody today. Would grass damage passive increase Lift Monk's skill? Yeah, because it increases Lift Monk's attack power, which would increase the damage that Lift Monk would be able to do, yes. Oh, is this close too, or does it just look like that now? What in Sam Hale is going on with my dungeons today? Well, there's a Melpaca here. God, I love love monks. Get in the ball. I said get in the ball. Get you son of a biscuit eating dirty freaking sausage loving melpaca. Ooh, it's got serious. Nice. Very good, very good. All right, have we caught all of our gooey boys yet? Oh my god, he's dead. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> this thing's about to have one choice. It's either death or get in the ball. Strawberry Shortcake might be a better name. I agree. Strawberry Shortcake, I think, takes the cake for the Melpaca name. I am exactly how far into the game as it looks like I am on the screen. <clears throat> oh, man. This is why... Uh How did I get that cucumbered? How? Really? Okay. I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff back right now. Oh! Cave's up. So it's just not loading in right. Weird. Very weird. Okay, I'm going into the cave now. <laughs> Jesus. I'm an idiot. I have... <laughs> I swear to God, I'm struggling today. 
when you switch from uh, from game to game, man, I swear to God, things just go awry in your brain. Right, we got a couple of mouse. Level six. Guess we don't need to catch those. Ooh, daydreams. Wouldn't mind a daydream. I think we're gonna do it. Level ooh. All right, so this is gonna be our first daydream, um, which means this is the one that we need to name. I'm gonna die. If it does not get in the ball, I'm dead. Oh my god. Get in the please. Please. Thank you. Freaking waterproof. <laughs> God. Is this the boss room already? No. The cave seems so much darker than it did before. Grape jelly, cotton candy, strawberry tart. Ooh, fruit loop. Oh, fruity loop. Cool whip. Ooh, Kilimari. I think this is the right direction. If they don't aggro, they kind of do. Okay, okay. We good, we good. All right, that's a dead end zone. Gumdrop. Kind of like gumdrop. Gumdrop for a daydream is its kind of fitting, I think. This tansy needs to get out of my team. Have I seen the bottom of those jellyfish pals, the stump of nightmares? No, I've never looked under one, unfortunately. And now I don't know if I want to. Not my gumdrop buttons. Mm -hmm. Gumdrop may have to be it. Okay, not the boss room. We do have some dudes in here. So this looks like a dead end room too. Is it? Yeah, it is. I think it is. You should pick four and let us vote. Oh my god. No, I get to pick. That's the fun of it. I get to pick. The choice of these caves is, uh... That's the end right there. Okay. Potentially never remembering which direction you need to go. And get it fuddled around. Oh no, the forbidden emoji combo. You disgust me. All right, what alpha bosses are we gonna have in here? Cause we can, ooh, not fight in those. <laughs> My whole plan was to catch, 
something that I really wanted. <laughs> we can't catch a deer, and I definitely don't want to fight him, so... Guess what we're not going to do. Game could use a minimap? For what? Use your eyeballs! Nah, I know minimaps are cool, but I feel like there's just enough stuff on the HUD already. I don't really want one. Ooh. Don't want boars. I wouldn't mind... You know, we're really only going to get options that are on this island. We've already caught Daydream. Saving our Daydream catch for the Alpha probably would have been the logical thing to do in retrospect. I'll trade a minimap for the constant feed of pals working, 100%. I think they fixed a lot of that, though. It used to be way worse. Oh, Ruby! Oh, Alpha Ruby would be great! We just need to not die. <gasps> oh god. Type advantage. We don't have a type advantage, but we do have a... You know. Not a bad bad thing. It was shocked. Yes! God, I love electric pals. It's a downtrodden alpha ruby. Ugh. We're gonna name it Chipotle because it's gonna give you Hershey squirts later. Because it's so bad. Ugh. And we got two rubies. <laughs> That's funny. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, Chipotle it is. All right, where's the... Let's see, are we going to replace this? This tansy doesn't exist to us. It's fodder. There we go. We got, we got Ruby. Oh, with 100% defense IV. God dang. Okay. Downtrodden defense. <laughs> so we got a 30% defense bonus because of the 100% dense uh, defense uh, IV. But we lost 10% of it because of that. So we have a 20% technically. Uh, Chipotle. And then we got a daydream. With a decent attack IV, I kind of want to replace... Ooh, do we want to use Ruby? Ruby is really good. Ruby will power up Flambe. I kind of want a Daydream, but we don't have a Daydream necklace anyways. I feel like Daydream will definitely help. Because it can attack all the time. I feel like... For this version that we're doing, it would behoove us to have a daydream necklace and a daydream in our party. Could call it Ruby Tuesday. <laughs> yeah. What is a Nuzlocke? A Nuzlocke is a self-imposed rule set that makes the game more difficult, challenging, or interesting, or all of the above. Am 
Bow, 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 bow. Oh my god, it's taking forever. God, do I miss having a uh, an Anubis. Well, we can breed for an Anubis soon. Which I really think we should do. Yeah, so we already have hard mode, but we, now we have a hard mode Nuzlocke, which is even harder. Perfect. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Pico di Giglio. Oh my god. Alright, unfortunately... We must pause here for the day. Did we get a ton of progress done today? No, but tomorrow I'll probably play a little bit behind the scenes and uh, get some gathering and crafting and stuff done before we stream the next one. So that way uh, we can go adventure out more. We're going to take down more bosses. I want to get in the next stream. We're going to get uh, our breeding farm built. I need to gather up stuff for our first cake. We need to get our first Anubis. And uh, do we get a second stream? No, I actually just got... Um, Important email for something that I got to take care of. So I got to do that. Uh, we'll be getting a uh, Nightingale soon, in a couple days. Um, but yeah, I do hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful night. And I'll see you all in the next one.